We tried Warrigal Greens and we didn't like them. Unfortunately, I can't give it away because it's all starting to go to seed. It's looking a bit, bit ratty. So I'm going to pull it out. And I'm going to chuck it just over the back there in my little subtropical attempt. Um, so that sort of microclimate I'm trying to build over the back there. I think knowing this stuff, it's going to continue to regrow and it'll make a nice ground cover, even if we don't eat the stuff. So I'm going to rip it out, chuck it over there, see what happens. So this is where we're going to put it. And I'm trying to create a little microclimate in here. And you can see that there's a tamarillo, bananas, right up the very back is a uh, black sapota, fig tree and pawpaws. So that will give a bit of height. And what I want at the bottom is some low end growth, preferably something we can eat if we need to, and just some ground cover. So let's get it ripped out and thrown over the fence. It's going everywhere. Hidden in there is some asparagus. There we go. Easy. And now I've got space to put some more stuff in. What are we going to put in here? What can tolerate a bit of shade? Quite a bit of shade. Something you can eat. Needs to be a veggie or a fruit of some kind. Let me know in the comments. Be interested to hear your opinions. The wind is blowing and my camera is shaking. So enjoy life. I'll catch you in the garden.